In this one, we are making the maiden voyage in the brand new Ponga, kicking it off at some good old Texas oil platforms, going spear fishing. Come along for it. This is Braden Dives. After a long time in the works, it's finally happening. The first trip, rocking and rolling in the new boat. I couldn't be more pumped. I'm ready to throw some fish on the deck of this thing. We've got my buddy Carson coming along today. He's going to be diving with me. And we have Sam, who's going to be helping us film. Here's a good look of the boat for y'all with the drone. Plan for the day is do some good old laid back, near shore, diving for snapper. Just give the boat a good shakedown, put it through the paces, double check everything is solid and working right, so I'm confident in ripping it out deep. Stay tuned, should be fun. Here we go. That boat's got a heck of a lot more V than we do. We're passing them up. On the way out, we have a two foot, five second interval swell with a bit of wind chop. Boat handles it like a champ. Have a pretty good heading, so that helps, but for what this is, I was very impressed. This is definitely an upgrade in ride. And we stayed bone dry all the way out, actually. And while this footage rolls here, I'm gonna tell y'all about the sponsor of today's video, BetterHelp an online platform designed to make starting and going to therapy easier. Being it's online, you can do it from anywhere. You have internet and on a schedule that works for you. Convenience and affordability is a big way that BetterHelp stands out. But also because of the huge selection of therapists they have to choose from. When you sign up, you fill out a questionnaire and BetterHelp will use that info to best match you with a therapist. And if it doesn't feel right, you can easily switch to another until you find someone that works best for you. With over 7,000 reviews and a four and a half star rating on Trustpilot, BetterHelp is a platform you can trust. So if you're struggling and think you can benefit from a therapy session, click the link in the description or go to betterhelp.com forward slash Braden Sharon and get a 10% off your first month. Yeah, first try. So we make it out. Carson and I start suiting up. And as you can see, we're in for some murky green diving. Now, I was expecting this. I figured it'd be good enough for shooting. But I did hope it would be a little bit better. Carson wasn't too excited about it. First dive ever out of the new boat. It is so eerie.
I swim inside the platform here and immediately we've got a tarpon hanging out that comes up to check me out while I'm getting loaded up I start making dives here's the highlights scoping things out and on this dive I decide I'm gonna shoot a mangrove I post up on this horizontal beam looking outside here patience is the key keep still wait for the clean shot and there we go My reel actually popped off of its mount there. So I was trying to deal with that while bringing this fish in. And I dispatch and bleed it here. And we get the first fish in the new boat. Big mangrove. Had to work for this one. They were playing smart outside the rig. These are fat ones, dude. Thank you. Saw a little red snapper. Hammer mangrove. I think it's probably 27 inches. So we dove through the first spot. I decided I want to keep chugging along and see if we can find some red snapper. We hit a couple spots that I've had a lot of luck on. but no dice. Now we fall back on diving for the mangroves, where here they are more than plentiful. And here's a look at what the dives look like here. At this spot, just posting up on this big horizontal area. About 10 feet beneath it, it just goes to complete murk. But there is tons 
of life, as you can see. On this dive, we have a spinner shark come cruising through the rig. We've got jacks cruising all over, spade fish, sheep's head, and mangroves. I gather myself here so I don't sink down into the dark murk. Pick out a mangrove that gives me a good shot and let it rip. I grab the spool of my reel to keep it from taking line and tangling up. The spinner shark actually darts in towards it after the commotion the fish is making, but thankfully it turns off of it and I'm able to wrestle this fish up. was hoping for the stone shot, but I could not for the life of me today stone one. And there, that shark actually came back up looking for this snapper. You can see it appeared and quickly turned back down. Whew. I was gonna lose this one. I think shark swooped in on him. Yeah, thankfully he didn't eat it. I think that's number four for the boat. Sweet. Might shoot one more. So I decided I was going to just get one more snapper. Carson and I were happy with what we got. We got what we wanted fish-wise. And this is my last dive. Same drill posting up. You can see it's just black murk down beneath me here I actually see a 
small gag grouper hanging out there. That's cool. And I'm just going to let the rest of this roll. is gonna do it for the diving in this one. Great first trip. This is gonna be a heck of a fishing and diving machine. Everything went smooth, boat ran awesome. I do need to tie up the wiring that connects my Simrad. That did keep losing power when we were underway. But other than that, the boat is good to go. And I now have a real world idea of the fuel burn we're gonna get. Our total trip average was right at four miles a gallon. So fuel range should be of no concern for anything I plan on doing, which is amazing. This boat is ready to rock. I'm ready to rip the heck out of it. Appreciate y'all tuning in. If you enjoy the video, hit that like button. It helps the channel out a bunch. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that button as well. I didn't get around to filming any cooking action in this one. Reason being, we just started going offshore a bunch. I actually go the next day after this trip, which will be the next video. So stay tuned for that, and I'll see y'all then. Also, one last thing, if you want to support the channel, you can check out my new seasoning line, Panga Powder, Ponga Powder, whatever you want to call it. It's on my website, link down in the description box below. I also have other stuff on there y'all can check out as well. If you're interested and want to help me out, really appreciate it.